All right, a local DJ is offering lessons on the basics of rhythm, song mixing techniques, and much more. Ashley Williams is live in Sacramento this morning learning how aspiring DJs can also make their dreams come true. Good morning, Ash. Yes, good morning. There is no age limit when it comes to learning how to DJ. Hence, this cutie pie here. This is Nico. Nico is seven and told her mom one day, I want to learn how to DJ. So why not take lessons from the one and only DJ Stace Lace? Yo, Nico, that was amazing. Uh, DJ Stace Lace is, I would say, um, a, a big name in Sacramento. Obviously, one of the King's DJs as well. First of all, DJ Stace Lace, good to see you. Good morning. Good morning. She has the headphones on. She's like in the zone right now. What's up, Nico? Good morning. All right, we're going to have some fun this morning, but Stace Lace, let's start with you. You've been DJing for some time, and, I, and I'm going to say this again, a household name in Sacramento. Um, what is it about DJing that you love and that you kind of talk to people about when they are inspired by you? Um, well, I already had a background in music, but I love music. I love to dance. I love to sing. And I love what music does for people. It just brings out all that nostalgia and good energy. And you can totally change a person's mood, their vibe for the day, just by putting on the right song. Yeah, no, I, I love that. We've been dancing all morning long. Uh, you teach kids and adults how to DJ. What is it that you see when people are learning for the first time? Oh, wow. Well, I like to see that spark in their eye, but also the potential for them to have something that's fun to do and something they can do something with in the future as well if they decide to be a professional. Yeah, and then for you to be a resident DJ for the Sacramento Kings, especially this season with all the energy in that arena, what's it been like? Oh, wow. Well, it's been loud. Like, uh, I feel my body vibrating just from all of the all of the voices that are so excited about the Kings winning. And it's just really uh, an amazing opportunity to be a part of that team yeah. and to bring the energy to the Golden One Center during the games. Yeah. What's really cool is uh, you DJ, your husband DJs, your daughter DJs, your son's a rapper. So this is like a big family business. So Nico, for you, uh, what is it about DJing that you love so much? Um, DJ is my like, um, I just love to like dance and sing about my own heart. You like to sing about your own heart. You like to DJ when it comes to your own heart. That is well said. What's your favorite music? What do you like to play for people? Um, Bruno Mars. Yeah, I would say Bruno Mars is a good one. Uh, when you see a seven-year-old come in, what is the first step to teaching them anything? Oh, well, first we have to make sure they understand beats and measures, um, just some fundamentals for music. And of course, before I start teaching anything, I do an assessment to see what they do know so that nothing is redundant or boring for them. And we can jump right into where they need to be. I love that. Okay, if people want to contact you, get some more information, have you DJ their events and or teach their kids how to DJ, how can they do that? Uh, it's easiest to contact me on Facebook or Instagram at DJ Stace Lace. All right, so coming up in the next hour, we're going to watch DJ, well, we're going to watch DJ Nico, but you're going to help her, right? So we're going to kind of see how she hits the ones and twos, and we're going to figure out kind of how it all works from jump. All right, take us out with a little something. We got to go. And we'll make sure to link everything to the website, gooddaysacramento.com. We'll see you in the 8 o'clock hour. Get it, Nico. Mom's a DJ, dad's a DJ, daughter's a DJ, and son's a rapper. Mm. I was telling you, it's impossible to overstate how much cooler that family is <laughs> than the one I grew up in. <laughs> Safe. Yeah.